Well, the remnants of Hillary, they continue to weaken, but they are still affecting parts of the West Coast. The storm lashed Southern California with heavy rain and strong winds, causing dangerous flash flooding, debris flows, and power outages. Fox 2 meteorologist Jamie Travers has a look at what residents have been dealing with. Hillary made landfall in Southern California as a tropical storm, the first to hit the state in 84 years. It brought record-breaking rains and at least 9 million people were under flash flood warnings Sunday into early Monday. Video shows the side of a road collapsing in Santa Clarita during one of those warnings. Some areas seen more than a half year's worth of rain in just a day. If you don't have a metric for what that's really like, you've never experienced it, especially in the place like the desert, um, it kind of almost doesn't even feel real. In Palm Springs, flooding was severe. Cars were stranded in the streets and businesses took on water. 911 lines were also down. The rain increasing the threat of mudslides. The water didn't have anywhere to go, so at the bottom point, it trenched into our driveway through a mudslide. Thousands were left without power as lines buckled under the water and wind and roads were turned into rivers of debris. This time it's, it, was, it was a river down the road with logs and, and boulders and everything. The California governor has declared a state of emergency, but the remnants of Hillary are now bringing heavy rains to Nevada. For Fox 2 News, I'm meteorologist Jamie Travers.